Good morning, Buchanan. I'm Riley Gonzalez. And I'm Gabe Monroe. Here are your morning announcements. If you're looking for a work-based elective, check out ROP Sports Medicine. Uh, the Sports Medicine Fitness class at Buchanan um, is a class where you're going to learn about uh, the body, you're going to learn about anatomy, how to treat, how to tape, how to uh, rehab. You'll be uh, trained in CPR and first aid and AED. Uh, you'll have a number of certifications on your resume. The students will go out to community classroom in athletic training, physical therapy, and fitness. So you will need transportation. Um, overall, it's just preparing you for the real world, seeing if these fields are right for you. Work permits are available on the Buchanan website under the Counseling tab. Attention Bears, have you gotten your yearbook yet? The deadline to purchase is April 9th. You can also purchase a memory page to honor a senior or promote a business. Last week, Buchanan's cross-country team hosted a competition here at Buchanan versus Clovis East. Buchanan's boys and girls teams both came out on top for the win. Are you looking to join a club? It's never too late. Go to the school's website for details. If you signed up for CSF, you can check your status on the CSF website starting Monday, February 15th. Are you interested in photography? Take a look at the photography classes here at Buchanan. And the ROP digital photography class, students start off with learning the basics, how to um, do the lighting, use a camera, do photo editing, all the same things we do in the first semester of intro to digital. Um, and then after that, about nine weeks, um, we start getting into Photoshop and learning more about lighting and how to do other pictures. And then during the second semester, we start doing um, assignments in groups and individually where the students are actually providing something to a client. And that client can be imaginary for an um, assignment or it can be a teacher or one of the coaches. And we'll be providing um, this product to them based on their, um, uh, like what they wanted. And that gives students practice for when they go out into the real world and try to make a living doing photography. So if you're interested in improving your photography for whatever reason, either for your social media page or for taking pictures at events, um, check out my class. We'll be back with sports after this. My name is Collis Clough, and I am Bear Spotlight. What do you want, kid? I don't think you've noticed, but this is a family establishment. Your raucous behavior and vulgar language is offensive to the staff and infringes on the experience of the other patrons. I've been acting since kindergarten, but I've done some more serious stuff since I was six. I've done a lot of films with uh, tremendous pictures uh, because my dad is one of the co-founders, probably one of the biggest reasons why. I've been in a movie called Holidays, it's on Netflix, and uh, if you want to see my hand, you can go check out the movie Prey on Amazon. And uh, I'm going to be playing the main character of a TV series called Deacon Jones that's currently being filmed. I plan on continuing acting because it's fun and I just enjoy making other people happy and entertaining people. Thank you, Buchanan, for making me your Bear Spotlight. Do you know of someone who would be a good candidate for Bear Spotlight? Contact Mr. Pierce for more information. Hey, Nate, what's up, man? Hey, not much. How about you? Oh man, I'm good. I, I was just going to get my yearbook today. It's a hundred dollars. It's a hundred dollars? Wait, did you hear, you hear that? What? Are you, are you, is that coming in from your end, man? I, I'm hearing some weird rustling. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, it's just, Yeah. I don't know, it's just a little weird. I, I think I'm just hearing stuff. Right. Um, yeah, your book, uh, get yours, get yours and I'll get mine and we could, uh, we could sign it or something or, okay. Oh, it's, it's you! What? I heard like, but you're just, you're just I'm just you're like just over, over here. here. Like you're over there. No, I, heard, I thought it was you're something just, in the book. Uh, no. Hey, welcome.
welcome to Fun Size. Okay, so this is a podcast, very first episode. This is a podcast of uh, Mini Me, my co host hey, over here, guys? and I talking about things uh, uh, as far as school goes. So we have an Instagram page uh, for BNN, that and that's what we're going to be talking about today. Yeah. We have to, we have to say good things about it. Not we can't say bad things. No bad okay. things. Okay, but how am I supposed to say something good about it when it's so bad? Okay, you just sit there then, and I'll I'll talk, and you just you just look pretty. How about that? Okay, so so like I was saying, we got this BNN page. It's got some funny content. It's got some informative stuff. Trust. <coughs> what? You heard me. I said it was trash. It's not trash. Yo, what's up, McKinnon? I'm Gabe Monroe, and I'm your spare bot light. I've been the news anchor for like a few months now, and it is really cool, but you know, it just to be like that sometimes, and I gotta like write the script and like show up and like say the words. So it's a really hard job, but we make it work, and it's pretty fun. Thank you, Buchanan, for making me your spare bot life. Um, Gabe, you uh, you got it's, a filter um, on. I I don't I don't know how to turn this filter off. Yeah. Um. Try going to your video settings. Yeah. Try to turn that off. Uh, I I'm not a cat. I I I, I can't figure it yeah. out. I don't want to yeah, be stuck the, as the a cat. Yeah. The filter is a cat. <sighs> Don't let me be stuck as a cat! <gasps> Hello! This episode of BNN is brought to you by the letters B, N, and N. That stands for Buchanan News Network. This is all possible because of viewers like you. Thank you. On this week's Bear Talk question. Yeah. What would you do if you won the lottery? What would you do with that money and why? I'd use the money to buy BNN from Mr. Pierce. What would I do if I won the lottery? I would save the money. Yeah, I would probably invest it because I've been told that it's the smart thing to do. I'd invest into stocks. I'd probably invest it on GameStop. Yeah, I would invest it to eventually make more money than what I started off with. I would invest it. Yeah, I'd put all my money in the stock market. Investing in stocks is a great way to make long-term profits. I'd get some books, get some knowledge. But you know what I like a lot more than materialistic things? Knowledge. If I won the lottery, I would probably buy a lot of chicken nuggets. Local man paralyzed after eating 413 chicken nuggets. This is Eliana Sandoval at the news desk. Attention students, peer counseling is now accepting applications for the 2021 to 22 school year. If you are interested in applying for the class,
please fill out the Google Form application on the BHS website. If you have any questions, please contact Mr. Martinez at marcosmartinez at cusd.com. Thanks guys, back to you. And we're back. Let's take it to sports for an interview. This is Caleb Pouliot with BNN, and today I interviewed Robert Buckenberger with Boys Basketball. During this time, we've been doing a lot of um, pickup games. We've been working out. We do a lot of workouts on, for PE on Zoom, and then we'll, have, we'll sometimes do FaceTime workouts. Pickup games have been really good because it's been working on our chemistry. It gets really competitive sometimes, so it's good to push each other and keep us in shape. It's just been overall super beneficial because it's getting us ready to play good competition. For the upcoming season, we've been, we're planning to stay in shape. We want to be the best we can if there were to be a season and just stay, stay ready, work on our defense, all around our chemistry and our game. I think if there were to be a season, we would, I feel like we would be a very, very good team. Well, that's all for today. We hope you have an amazing Friday. This is Riley Gonzalez. And Gabe Monroe, signing off. Take care, Buchanan. Oh, what's in the box? Oh. Hey, it's time to break down the set. It's time to break down the what? <laughs>